Now, the first time you do something, anything, it's difficult. Archery, model making, eating spiders. It's particularly hard to make your first game. And now, with the tools to do so so readily available to anyone with time and ideas, the competition for our debut game award is stiffer than ever. Even Kanye West has said he's working on a game, but there's a debate as to whether or not we should let him finish. <laughs> to present the award... <laughs> that was a weird reaction, like Kanye's people are in the room. Eh? <laughs> To present the award for debut game, would you please welcome the CEO of UK Interactive Entertainment, Dr. Joe Twist. The Debut Game Award was a fiercely fought battle this year with some incredible titles vying for nomination. All of the games submitted were first titles from both studios and individuals in 2014. And the meteoric rise of video game sales of the past few years has seen a massive influx of new and exciting projects coming to fruition in recent months. Indie producers, crowdfunded titles and dedicated new startups have all joined the fray to enter the contest this year. But only one of these tasty technological treats can take the debut game award title. Let's see who's in the running. Debut game. Last night, I had a dream. The Banner Saga. Counter Spy. Hitman Go. Never Alone. Kissima Ingetuna. Shovel Knight. The Vanishing of Ethan Carter. And the BAFTA for debut game goes to Never Alone. Never alone when you've got a batter by your side. It's always watching. Never alone, an exploration of Alaska Native cultures and history. The development team collaborated closely with Alaska Native storytellers and elders to create this game. It is a wonderful mix, documentary, platformer, and just all round great game. Go ahead. Hi, guys. Uh, my name is Dima Virovka, and I'm the art director on this game. It's amazing to be here. I'm totally like we didn't expect that. And for us, I don't know. It's <clears throat> it's it's we create a game to celebrate the culture, and that's this kind of a word mm -hmm. bring us on completely different level. We celebrate it with all the people because so many people when involved in this project. I wanted to say thank you for everyone who support the project. All the people that guide us and teach us how to make and how to love the culture and I, I just don't know, I, I, I felt like that's the most meaningful project for myself and for my, all, all the people and all the family in E-Line. I wanted to say big thank you to Gloria and you. Mm -hmm. She was, uh, that was her idea, she, she decided to make a game about Alaska Native people and uh, she contacted uh, E-Line Media and Mike Angst and uh, Alan uh, Gronschenfield, they took this challenge and they said, let's do that. So big thank you to them. They hired Sean Vesey, our creative director. I really miss him here. I would like him to be here, but uh, he created the team. I was one of, I'm one of them. And I wanted to say a uh, few words I wanted to say, like uh, from Ishmael. Ishmael, our writer. He actually Alaska Native, and he taught us everything what we did there. 
Kuyana, this is a beautiful honor. Our elders would say, Arega. They would say, this is amazing and wonderful. And I am here because of our elders, the vision and love and beauty of, of our elders. So, Kuyana. Thank you, guys.